uh, with the ETSU marching band. This is going to be a huge highlight today. Getting to come into Manila Stadium, the marching band perform here uh, right in front of all the fans. Ashley Sharp spoke with them ahead of their big debut. Hey guys, it's not all about football today. We want to highlight another group of students on campus who have been growing alongside the football program since their reboot three years ago. The ETSU Marching Bucks are also taking the big stage in Neyland this afternoon. For years, the music coming from these instruments fell silent on ETSU's campus. Of course, there was no marching band for about 12 years. And when football came back, uh, the plan was to also reestablish the marching band. The return of Buccaneer football three years ago, meaning the ETSU marching bucks were also making their big debut. So when the football team came back, we were so excited that we were also asked to come back as well. And now three years in, the band is the largest in school history. And it's continued to grow. We were, we were really excited last year when we broke 200. And this year, we broke the record again. We have 245 in the band. 245 members packing their instruments and hitting the road for their first away performance. We've been kind of counting down the days. Ready for their biggest stage yet. It's a little bit of a, an adrenaline rush for us. The halftime show at Neyland Stadium in front of more than 100,000 fans. That will be by far our biggest crowd that we performed in front of. So it's a little nerve wracking, um, but I think we've prepared enough that we'll be successful. The band ready to bring some blue and gold pride to that sea of orange and white. We're ready to cheer them on. We're ready to do our show and hopefully win. A lot of people don't realize that the, the band is back at ETSU, and um, I think the students are looking forward to going down and, and uh, making a great first impression. The ETSU marching bugs say that they're excited to play in such a big arena like Neyland Stadium, and they're ready to make their friend, their fans proud. Bucks football players joined the band in their excitement. But Kane, you learned that despite divided loyalties among families, the Bucks want their friends and families to be wearing blue and gold.